know you're busy, Fred, but I just wanted to make sure you understand how much I, um, you know, respect you and your family and everything they stand for. And uh -huh. that has to be fully understood. Right, got it. Fred, you're not listening. Casey, I'm trying to do something here. I just need two seconds. OK, sorry. Full attention. Go. OK, um, well, uh, the thing is this. You see, I was thinking that it would be best for us if um, we, and by that I mean all of us, if, if, you get the part about respect? Oh, yeah, yeah, you respect to me, my family, and everything we stand for. Yeah, good, good, excellent, okay. Uh, okay, uh, you know what? Let's maybe let that sink in for a while, and, and then we can, we can talk about it more later. That's it? That's it. Love you. Love you, too. Bye, sweetie. Bye, Mom. Your mom's weird, Ike. Dad! What? This will be great for catching fly balls or, or dropping water bombs or, or checking out which one of my teachers is wearing a toupee. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling you, Dad, this one's going to make it famous. Well, let's get you down first. <laughs> Ukrainian weddings in one week. <laughs> Look, I hate June. <laughs> I hate June. There's another good one. Boy, that low voice character is the hub of the show. The guy's pretty good, too. Talk about a fatty. I can't get comfortable. This couch is so lumpy. I haven't worked with that much white since that time we decided to scale Kilimanjaro. <laughs> <laughs> There I was, wearing leather-soled slip-ons. <laughs> <laughs> and then Celia had to slip and fall into that chasm. Don't start on yourself! I was helpless. All I could do was watch her fall. There was nothing you could do about it. But if I hadn't insisted that she come with us... Well, how were you to know it was a brain tumor? Even the doctors weren't sure. He thought it was some kind of cellulite condition. All of a sudden, they go dramatic. Stop Shh. blaming yourself, Mark. When does that happen? Oh, you <laughs> hate when they do that. I guess when the couch gets old, everything sags and the springs go. Could I say something, Katie? You are one great lady, and you just wipe all of that hurt out of that pretty little head, madam. <laughs> Besides, you have a bridal gown to finish. <laughs> bridal gown? There wasn't enough silk for the bridal gown. This is a tent for the wedding! <laughs> oh. <laughs> no! I hate when they do that. That's it. Oh, okay. What a cheap... One minute they're bumming you out, the next minute they're going for laughs. All they're doing is probing at your yin-yang in a highly entertaining fashion, I might add. 
Yeah, well, look, I refuse to be toy with. Oh! Oh, relax. That's a beauty in Augahyde. It'll evaporate. Oh, sorry, Case. Oh, this old thing. Are you kidding? Anything would be an improvement. What are you talking about? I love this couch. Well, I'm off. Got a new book of the month, and I only got 48 hours left on the big 10 day free trial. Good night. Good night, Idella. Good night, Idella. There. There we go. Oh, Fred. Mm hmm? That thing we were uh, talking about before? Uh, yeah, you respect me and my family. See, I remember. Good, good, okay. Um, well, I should, first of all, I should preface by saying, you know, I love this house. Mm, so do I. I really love it, except, you know, for the odd, tiny little thing. Uh-huh. Wait, wait, let me put that another way. Um, look around you, Fred. Hmm? What do you see? I see our living room. Right, good, excellent. Now, maybe take another look around, and this time, tell me what colors do you see? I see lots of colors. No, you don't, Fred. You see brown. Brown, 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 brown. That pillow over there is orange. Which I put there. In which I like. <sighs> OK, um, maybe let's just start again. Uh, Case, can I give you some advice? If you have something to say, say it. Remember, this is old Freddy boy, the love of your life. Fred, I want to redecorate the living room. What? Are you nuts? I knew you'd react like this. Well, you just don't dump something like this on a person. What happened to old Freddy boy? Dad. Not now, Ike. I'm hungry. Ike, uh, Ike, I, I told you. You gotta stay low to the ground. That effect's gonna wear off soon. I'm starved. There's some cake in the fridge, honey. Hurry up. Are you guys having a fight? Fight? Now, who's having a fight? We're just having a little talk, sweetie. Sounds like a fight to me. No. Uh, no. No, no. Oh. <laughs> no. No, no. No, no. No, no way. No. <laughs> Every time I suggest changing one little thing in this shrine, you make me feel like I'm Jackie Onassis redecorating the Lincoln bedroom. Yeah, but I went with that orange pillow. After an argument. But I eventually went with it. Mom. Yes, honey. The top of the fridge is dirty. You want me to clean it while I'm up? No, no, that's OK. We'll take care of it later. OK. Oh, I fixed the skylight in your bedroom. It opens easier now. Ike, you could have been sucked out. Don't worry. I was holding on. And keep low to the ground. See, Fred, I don't interfere when you experiment on the children. That's your domain. But when you're down in that lab, I'm up here. And I am a very visual person. I need the right kind of physical environment. And what does that mean? That you just throw everything out? I mean, what about the rest of us? Everybody seems to like things the way they are. It's OK, Fred. It was a bad idea. Forget it. I mean, you know, you just don't throw everything out, get rid of everything. I mean, you've got to think these things through. Right. I mean, you know, I don't want to be the villain. I've got to put my foot down sometimes. I know. You know? Yeah. Well, don't you want to argue? What's the point? Once you've made up your mind, you don't change it. Good. Good instinct, because, you know, it's, uh, I've, I've thought this through myself, and it's, it's, my, it's my thinking. Want some tea? No, thanks, but I appreciate the offer. I don't know. If it's that important, I, I guess I could bend. I mean, no man's an island. Oh, Fred, wait till you see what I picked out. A great new couch, a new rug. You're really going to love it. Fred, are you coming to bed? Be right up.
right up. Here's my gift for you, son. My own set of keys! For what? The moped! And Kineski's window! That's right. Oh, now I can deliver my papers on time! I love you, Dad! I love you, Mom! I love my life! I hope it always stays safe! Fred? Fred? Hmm? Hmm? Big day tomorrow. Got those movers coming. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs>